Why, hello everyone, and welcome back to Samcast GS! Aren't you so excited I'm back? Maybe you're not so excited, but I'm excited, and that's, you know, that's good. You guys don't have to be too excited, but you could be a little excited, maybe. Anywho, I'm not gonna get into why I didn't make a video for a really long time. I will say this though, I finally got an iPod Touch so I can make high quality vlogs with this and I will be able to actually see myself on the uh, screen. Or my nose itch for a second, that's why I stopped to, you know. But yeah, it's like my camera, I couldn't see myself on the screen in that flip video thing that had the red stamp of death, I couldn't see my face, but now I can see my face. I need to realize where the camera is, it's right here. And it's like, I keep, not getting it. But anyway, I hope you all enjoyed your Easter. I certainly enjoyed mine, except for one part of my Easter. And that was Easter morning mass at Holy Spirit Catholic School, where I went as a child and I was taught about God and the horribleness of hell. Like they really elaborated on how horrible it is to be in hell. Catholic school was almost like threatening you to do good things. I'm gonna scooch a little bit so I'm in the center of the screen. Again, this camera, it's like I'm, I'm not used to this. I'm used to my laptop but my desk upstairs it's really dark and it's the lighting is just horrible so I'm gonna do it here but the lighting is much better as you can see literally you can see ha <laughs> get it get it uh, never mind but anyway we went to Easter morning mass we get to the part where it's time for communion actually first of all one of the things I didn't like about it is because the church was packed so we and about like 40 other people were just lined up against the wall. So we just had to stand the entire time, the entire like hour that this thing was going on. But that's not the best slash worst part. We got to communion and they have those little wafers and the wine, but I never take the wine because it's just eh. that. And they have like this little towel that they just kind of just barely kind of wipe the edge of the glass. Like they're not even cleaning it. They're just kind of, eh. but we're getting off topic. So I went to get the communion wafer. I had my hands like this. I had my hands in the bowl. And then she said, the body of Christ. And then I promptly said, amen. And when you do that, the person holding the wafer is supposed to place it in your hand. If your hands are like this, or place it on your tongue, it's like this. I don't know who does that. I actually saw a guy do that when I was waiting for our turn. But anyway, I'm waiting there with my hands cupped and she doesn't do anything. She's just kind of standing there like this. And so we're standing there for like two seconds, which doesn't seem like a long time, but for the time that it takes to just say the body of Christ, amen, and then put the wafer in your hand, that's a ridiculous amount of time not to be doing anything. So I went to grab it because she wasn't doing anything. She didn't know what she was doing. I felt so awkward. I went to grab it and then she like moved her hand. I was like, just let me have the wafer. You're not supposed to deny me Jesus. So that was fun. But then I got to hang out with my family, both sides of my family. We went to my grandpa Joe's for breakfast. I had turkey bacon, pancakes, and scrambled eggs. That is the best breakfast, for me at least. I'm not gonna make assumptions about the rest of the world, because I, again, as I stated in a video a while back, I don't know really anything outside of this general area. I can't speak for everyone in the world because I am me and you guys are you guys. And now I'm talking about this, like I'm actually going somewhere with it, but I'm not going somewhere with it. I'm just kind of talking and it's not really going anywhere. So I'm gonna stop talking about this. After breakfast, we went to my Aunt Amy's house and we met up with all of my father's side of the family. We had a grand old time. I was wearing this really bright pink shirt. My brother Patrick was wearing a really clear blue shirt. And then my uncle Alan was wearing a very purple shirt. And then my cousin Allie was wearing a very red dress. So we were like the Easter eggs of the Strand Easter celebration. It was fantastic. So anyway, that should just about do it. Feel free to subscribe. There's a link to my channel in the description as always. Also, feel free to leave a comment in the comment box about your Easter celebration. And I'm gonna get back to making videos. I promise. And I'm gonna start making vlogs with my new iPod, which is gonna be great. I'm gonna try and make a vlog tomorrow. But if I don't see you tomorrow, thanks for tuning in and I will see you all on Wednesday.